Hey there, it's Dan Wardrobe here. How are you? Today I want to talk to you about uh, uh, blending leads, okay? And this is a, a little bit of a taboo subject with some clients, obviously, because they want to have the best quality leads all the time. Um, the likely scenario is that that's not always possible. So for those of you who are more advanced, you might be sending leads from Facebook and you might be sending leads from Google search and you might be sending leads from YouTube and you might be sending leads from Twitter, whatever, okay? Each of those different platforms usually bring different quality of leads, especially if you're using an advertorial funnel, which generally um, seems to push the quality up a little bit, okay? So problem with that though, is that those, you know, let's say, or even YouTube, for example, YouTube ads are what we, we've found to be almost twice as good in quality, but um, they sometimes cost twice as much to produce. Not always, but, but sometimes, right? So you wanna be able to uh, supply both sets of leads to the client and find that, that balancing act between them ordering again and then getting, and getting really good results and ROI in their spend and you making enough money um, and you know, just sending them a load of crappy leads that they're, they're never gonna convert and then, which means they're never gonna order again. It is really a, uh, a fine line. And what we found, and of course this is a more advanced tip, is that you wanna start your clients and their sales team um, with the best quality leads early in the day, all right? Um, you wanna be able to uh, send those YouTube leads across, those advertorial leads for the first you know, nine to nine a.m. till midday, whatever that is, okay, and then start introducing the poorer quality leads a little bit later on in the afternoon. And what you'll find is that they gain some momentum, um, the sales team gets excited, and it, it generally helps conversions a little bit better. And then you make a, a little bit more margin later on in the day. So, um, it's a it's a high level tip, right? There's not a lot of people that are, are, are doing a lot of volume with different traffic networks, but if you are, then this could really help, and I, ho I hope it does. You should give it a go. Um, I hope you've enjoyed this video. Uh, if you are a budding paper leader and you want to get into um, paper lead and build a business, then there'll be a case study below this video where you can watch um, watch how we do it, how we did it, and um, I hope you enjoy. Chat soon.